How are you? I'm good. What is your name? <laughs> what is your name? Josephine. Josephine. Yeah, Jose. How old are you? I'm 25 and some months. Are you single? Yeah. Would you be interested in dating a man from the U.S.? Definitely, yeah. Hmm. And just to get an idea of what you do for a living, who you are, and what you expect and what you can give in return, <laughs> just give me a brief statement. <laughs> I can't do this. <laughs> I'm sitting here for a second. This is Stephen and Josephine, live in Ghana, and we want you to keep watching, tracking Ghana, so stay tuned. Thank you. <laughs> Hello, my kiss. <laughs> This is Steven, Ghana, Tracking Ghana. We're here with Lisa, also known as Ruby. Lisa, would you like to give your whole name? What is it? Ruki Ibrahim. Ruki is how old? 26 years old. Ruki is single. Her religion is that of a Muslim. And she's seeking also a single Muslim brother. Around the ages of around the ages of 30. Ruki, would you like to give a little bit of information more about yourself? No kids, kids? Ruki has no kids. Do you prefer to have kids? How many? Two or three. So, anything else you'd like to share? So, um, where do you live? That's also good to know. Accra. Also, Ruki lives with her aunt. And um, your occupation? Her occupation is that of a caterer. So once more, that's Ruki Ibrahim, who's 26 years old. So this is Stephen Lyles for Tracking Ghana. So if you'd like to get in touch with Ruki, you know where to reach me at, and then we'll take it from there. <laughs> this is Stephen with Tracking Ghana. Today we are with Linda Ofori. Ofori. Age. 22. 22 years of age. Located within Ghana. Ghana. And what region? What Ashanti region. Ashanti region. And living in Accra? Yeah, living in Accra. Living in Accra. <laughs> and are you still single? Yeah, I'm single. Today's date is April. 24th of 2011. 23rd? Well, we're on the Easter Sunday, so. And they know it's most recent. It's 24th. 24th, so yeah, let's stick with the 24th. <laughs> so, are you still single? Yeah, I'm single. And what are you looking for? Is it a man for marriage, man for friendship, man for dating? No. What man should we know? For dating. So we see what God can make it out of it if you get married. And are you looking to establish a family as far as having kids? Yeah. Any specific amount or you know, just give us something just give us a little info what you see your life like or what you would want it to be like if you met that right one. Really happily 
married couple, a mixed family, and we live happily. Yeah. Do you believe in always being there for your man, doing what's necessary? Yeah, and also always be there for my man. Yeah. So we know bad Ghan times and good times, I'll be there for him. And we know Ghanaians are famous for that, always being able to stick it out through the thick and thin. So it's always. And you, what about your faith? What is it that you believe in? I believe in God. Are you uh, anything in particular? Maybe Christian, Muslim, whatever I'm it may Christian. be. Christian. Yeah, I'm Christian. Okay. I'm and at this point in time, do you have any kids? No, I don't have any kids. All right. And what is your occupation? I'm a beautician. Beautician? Yeah. Oh, so we always know you'll stay beautiful for your man. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Do you know your height? Not exactly. About five, 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 six. About five, six it is. About five, six, about 145. So nice size, nice height. <laughs> Beautiful, dark-skinned Ghanaian woman here for you. <laughs> Once more. <laughs> I, gotta, I gotta edit all this in myself. Once more, this is Steven for Tracking Ghana. Stay tuned for our next episode. Thank you. <laughs> Close up, smile hard. Now do one without smiling. I'm tired. Uh. I'm gonna do a turn around for the camera. Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> Is it okay? Mm hmm. <laughs> Turn all the way around now. So I'll wait. <laughs> I had to do a real zoom close up on your breasts. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we good. <laughs>